Hey, what's going on, Goofy? My name is Jay93, and welcome back to another Nerf review. And a yes, I know this is filmed on the exact same day as it did with the Flip Fury, because as you see, I'm wearing the exact same shirt. Yes, the daylight actually hasn't changed behind me. So, uh, yes, another Zombie Strike. Huge blaster. Not really blaster, but you know, but it's a, it's a brain saw, which it's combined with a chainsaw and a blaster. Where, where as you can see, it, just taking a look at the detail, you have the chainsaw feature, whereas this, the foam part is chainsaw, but, see my viewers, this is actually not how a chainsaw would operate, just this part. But again, it's a toy, so realism, not really, not really that big of a deal, but uh, yeah. This kind of trains people to go act up with just a tip. But yeah, for for like zombies, yeah, they're a tip. But if you're trying to cut down a tree with a chainsaw, just chop, chop down anything regular, it wouldn't just go like that because it wouldn't give you much like area to actually hit. But you got it from the side. So you just chop it like, like, like you would with a double handle axe. So you swing like that. But if you swing it, these parts are plastic, so you will be hitting things quite quite hard. And uh, yeah, I don't know if you guys saw this, but it says brain saw. And uh, yeah, you do have like all the parts. I mean, you do have a ta tactical reel right here. So if you want to hold it like that, but you really can't see it because my line of sight is looking directly into it. But if you have a scope kind of angled. Yeah, you might be able to just, just pump and go do do. But yeah, the pump here is it's basically just a screwdriver. And we just pump it. And just seeing here, you can see it's just a whole bunch of stuff thrown together. The garage has what's the zombie shark line. And right here, you get the pull handle as I was doing in the beginning. You pull it, and it spins the, it spins the foam disc at the front. Now, it really looks like a chainsaw, but they they threw in the a handle back here, so so you so you can actually hold some. But uh, yeah, this trigger pull back here, it's for the actual like firing. And uh, back here, you have the handle, and you also have a sling mount. Now, if you want, I don't know why you would put this on a sling mount. You probably use this as just an attack weapon. This is good range, close close range. But yeah. I will be doing a firing of this one, and my firing one is coming up soon, so stay tuned, and, uh, yeah. <coughs> oh, look, see, I mean, I think it's the first time I see these on video, but, uh, yeah, you do have the actual carrying handle. Once it's in, you can't attach it, but, uh, I highly recommend you put a carrying handle so it gives you more, less weight on one of your hands, or you can just carry it like that. But yeah, what's, what's the point of having a chainsaw if you don't have a camera? It makes you feel like a chainsaw while well, it's going to zzz, cut around like that. Now, to, to fire, it fires eight. Now, if you don't have a dart in one of these, like if I take the dart out and I pump it, it'll go from this side to the other side, I believe. But uh, it, it won't dry fire. Uh, it won't just continuously go down. It'll skip. There's a smart air restrictor inside here. If there's no dart in it, it'll stumble over and fire the next one that has a dart in it. So yeah, which is what I think that's cool. So yeah, I'll fire it twice in my room. So yeah, and you will see, see me get hit with, with these darts. Yeah, this just proves that it does not actually go, it go alternate sides. So you fire one from here, goes here. Now if you don't have it, one here, It'll go straight to here, so just 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 doing a test of it. I have one one dart loaded here, priming it, fired that. But since I don't have anything here, my guess is it'll fire down here. I don't know. Well, it just it went to the other side of the other side and the second one down. So it if I has fired on both sides. And the line it doesn't isn't one it jumps in the next one on that side so uh yeah as you see i haven't fired this many times but uh yeah i don't have a chronograph or adequate space to fire that is in my room so uh yeah more practical maybe 
because th this is pretty intimidating I'm seeing somebody coming at you with this but it also causes you quite a lot of bruises if you were to get hit by this swinging it yeah yeah I, I I clearly would not want to use this because I didn't see because when you swing at this you're most likely gonna be hitting like this area here you get a more plastic natural rubber itself so uh yeah, not really practical. And also, I just, I know it's just a slim mount here. Right here, I don't know why it's there. Probably to even balance, but I don't think Nerf knows what a chainsaw is. Because when you spin this, you can see there are blades going here. Now, if you put, obviously, they expect you to have that, but a regular chainsaw, these go forward, and you might cut off something that you put through here. So yeah, if you guys have a real chainsaw, I would not recommend you touching the, touching the teeth part because these are actually sharp in real chainsaw, but this is Nerf, so not sharp. So yeah, overall, the weight is good. So yeah, if you really want an intimidation factor, you want to put on your shoulder, yeah, that's fine. That's intimidation, but actually firing it or actually using it as a weapon, no, would not actually recommend it. Just Intimidation factor as a guard, yeah, you can use that. But uh, yeah, so yeah, just cool. I just really like these uh, the zombie strike line because it shows you can essentially just build anything out of parts you have, but you gotta make sure it works. So uh, yeah, that's gonna wrap it up for my review of the brain saw. Yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this review. If you have, please be sure to hit that like button right below. Subscribe if you're new, and uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching, and fly our pods.